You know, many times when I travel or talk to other business partners, they say it's really too bad. You know, you're in Newfoundland, it's a small province, there's you know, limited opportunities. And I say, oh no, it's the polar opposite. Because we live in a small province and because we've got a tight-knit community and because the love of this land is in our DNA, this is what we do to support one another. We think outside the box. 25 years ago, we were starting to see the precursor of an aging demographic and the incidence of chronic diseases increasing and so on. So in its current form, the system simply wasn't sustainable. We couldn't possibly continue to provide hands-on care and bricks and mortar facilities like we'd always done. So if you can find a viable solution to offer the same level of care at a lower cost and more accessible care, it just made sense to pursue the opportunity. And what can we do with technology? You know, how can we monitor patients better at home who've got COPD, for example, and are concerned about their oxygen levels, or diabetics, especially newly diagnosed diabetics, who are so concerned about blood sugar fluctuations and so on. How do we counsel them and manage them at home? Well, now we've got the technology, so patients can check their readings at home and upload them, and, and we can reach out proactively and manage those patients at home before their condition deteriorates to the point that they need hospitalization. With COVID-19, we had a 1,500% increase in demand for service within 48 hours. So you can only imagine what it was like to try to scale up and respond to the demand for care in two different countries at the exact same time. We were able to move our platform to be able to respond to the demand because we have the cloud-based infrastructure in place, because we've got the clinically validated medical protocols already loaded into our database, we could respond very quickly to the demand. And we increased our lines from, say, 100 concurrent lines to 300 concurrent lines within an hour. So because we had invested in the technology infrastructure already early on, in preparation for advancement of our services, we could respond very quickly. Technology in Newfoundland in general has advanced to the point where we've got the spotlight the infrastructure is here, the culture is here, and what a great time to just start a brand new company because the opportunities are endless.